I'm Sebastian, and this is for Mrs. Men's class, and we're reading Sheila Ray, The Brave, by Kevin Hanks. Sheila Ray wasn't afraid of anything. She wasn't afraid of the dark. She wasn't afraid of thunder or lightning. She wasn't afraid of the big black dog at the end of the block. At dinner, Sheila Ray made believe that the cherries on her fruit cocktail were eyes of a dead bear's, and she ate five of them. At school, Sheila Ray giggled when the principal walked by, and when classmate Wendell stole her jump rope during recess, Sheila Ray tied him up until the bell rang. I'm very brave, Sheila Ray said, patting herself on the back. Sheila Ray stepped on every crack in the sidewalk without fear. When her sister Lewis said there is a monster in the closet, Sheila Ray attacked it. And she rode on her bicycle, no handed with her eyes closed. Yeehaw! Yay, yay! Sheila Ray and her friend yelled, clapping their hands. One day, Sheila Ray decided to walk home from for a new way. Lewis was afraid. You're too brave for me, Lewis said. You're always such a scaredy cat, Sheila Ray called. I am not, whispered Lewis. Sheila Ray started off skipping. I am brave, she said. I am fearless. She stepped on every crack. She walked backwards with her eyes closed. <sighs> she growled at stray dogs. She bared her teeth at stray cats. And she per pretended that trees were evil creatures. She climbed up them and broke their fingers off. Snap, 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 snap. Sheila Ray walked and walked. She turned corners. She crossed streets. It suddenly occurred to Sheila Ray that nothing looked familiar. Sheila Ray heard frightening noises. They sounded worse than thunder. She thought horrible thoughts. Ah. They were worse than anything she had ever imagined. I am brave, Sheila Ray convinced herself. I, I am fearless. The sound became more frightening. The thoughts became more horrible. Sheila Ray sat down on a rock and cried. Nope! She sniffled. I thought of her mother and her father and Lewis. Mother, father, Lewis! She cried. Here I am, a voice said. Lewis! Sheila Ray hugged her sister. We're lost, Sheila Ray said. No, we're not, said Lewis. I know the way home. Follow me. Lewis stepped on every crack. She walked backwards with her eyes closed. She growled at stray dogs and bared her teeth at stray cats. 
and she pretended that trees were evil creatures. She jumped up and broke their fingers off. Snap, snap. Snap, snap, snap. Sheila Ray walked quietly behind her. They walked and walked. They crossed streets. They turned corners. Soon their house could be seen between the trees. Sheila Ray grabbed Lucius and dashed to the and dashed up the street. Pew! When they reached their own yard and the, closed the gate behind them, Sheila Ray said, Lewis, you are brave and fearless. We both are, said Lewis. And they walked backwards into the house with their eyes closed. This book is Sheila Ray, the Brave, and um, she was fearless and she stepped on every crack without fear. And when somebody at a school stole her jump rope, she tied him up until the bell rang. Then, um, when the principal walked by, she giggled. And then, um, she, one day she decided to go to the, to go home a different way. And she stepped on every crack and he said, I'm Sheila Ray. I'm fearless. And, and then, um, after a while, um, she went, um, somewhere she never gone before and, and she kept on on a rock crying, and her sister came, and um, said she said we're lost. Nope, we're not. And she knew, and she knew the way home, and she crossed streets, went corners, and then um, they finally reached home, and she dashed inside with her eyes closed and her and walking backwards. Bye.